it's Chelsea here, and today we're going to talk about my hair swim routine thing. Okay, so y'all know over the summer I got all that damage from swimming and not know what to do with my hair and just, you know, jacking it up. So this is my routine and how I keep my hair nice and healthy and what I'm doing so far and what seems to be working. Okay, and I went swimming yesterday, so this is what happens in the morning. Okay, so first, um, my hair had been previously styled and flat ironed. The only thing on my hair was um, coconut oil after I let it air dry. Is that showing? Okay. And this, when I flat ironed it, the olive oil polisher. Okay. So, um, what I did was I took a hair band and I tied my hair in a ponytail and I went swimming like that. Now, I didn't use a swim cap because they pull out my hair and I don't like them and they hurt and they're uncomfortable. And, you know, a million other reasons. And plus, I don't think they're attractive. Not that I be, you know, at the pool trying to look cute, but that whole dolphin look doesn't work for me. But anyway, once I got out of the pool, I shampooed twice with this, the Organic Root Stimulator Olive Shampoo. Um, once for all the, you know, water and chlorine, then to get out the, you know, polish or anything else that was in there. Um, and I put this on for five minutes per the direction, the Airline Oil Intense Hydrating Mask, which works pretty well. And I like it. I rinsed that out while I was still at the um at the gym, the pool, or whatever. And then I put in a few dollops of Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioning Cream. And after that, I put in a few drops of coconut oil over my whole head. And then I detangled with my rake comb, which basically I went from bottom to top you know, all the way to the roots, just to make sure there were no major tangles. Pushed on my hair pack, pinned it up with this hair band, and let it air dry. And it dries, you know, pretty straight. So after that, um, I got out the pool at around like six o'clock, spent the rest of the day, you know, running around with my friends, going to dinner and what have you. And when I got back to my room that night, I put some shea butter on my hands, the cancer shea butter, and I put that mostly on the ends of my hair and a little bit on the front and a little more coconut oil. And with that being on my hair, my hair was very pliable, not really damp, but, you know, moist. And it would hold the shape of whatever I wanted to do. So I got me a silk scrunchie, which I bought from LEI, the jean store. I don't know how to say that. Lee, Lee, whatever. I bought it from there and I took my hair pulled it back and twisted it up. Can you see that? And one knot, just a bun back there. And then I tied it up with two loops with the silk scrunchie. It wasn't tight and wasn't on like the base of my head. It was just on the actual bun. So it was very loose at this point. Then I put on my headscarf. And this is very, the long one which I got from Walmart for like $3. And it's sad. And I tied around the back. And that's how I slept on it. And it stayed on for the first time I woke up. Then when I went back to sleep and woke up this morning, it came off. But it pretty much stays on unless I'm, you know, tossing and turning or something. And took that off, took that down this morning, fluffed it out, and I pretty much got something like this. I took um my hands and fluffed it up, flipped it over, combed out the just the roots a little bit for volume and flipped it back and put on a headband and that's my swimming routine style I will be working with and I will be swimming twice a week for the fall I think that'll be good that's Michaela over there anyways 
that seems to be working for me. It seems like a lot of products, but it's, you know, really not. And it's, it's very simple for me. And it, it's working. My hair is moisturized. It's soft. My ends are wonderful. So that's my hair. My new girl, I've been keeping moisturized with the coconut oil mostly. It's been laying down and just being very nice to me. So I love that. But anyway, that's my swim routine that I will be following for the fall and what I've been doing lately with my hair. So probably going to be wearing my hair curly a lot, but using no heat, which is kind of awesome. So that's that. Anything else? No, I don't think so. Okay, well then. So talk to you later. Bye.